everybody, and welcome to be playing a game called Style Savvy or Style Boutique. Depending on what you want to call it. First thing we're going to do today is... Makeover time! Well, I mean, kind of a makeover. We're going to be, uh, picking out a new outfit for ourselves. And living it up because we get access to all the clothes that we buy. I'm gonna go with Mad Jack because that seems like it's the most popular thing that I'm selling. So, you know, gotta match my looks to my customers' tastes because they see me styling. They're gonna be like, oh snap, this girl knows what she's doing. She knows how to be styling and profiling. I want her to be styling and profiling me. And that's how it's gonna go down, y'all. Now, see, the thing is, I like monochrome. I'm really bad at fashion in real life. I don't know what I'm doing in the fashion world. Don't know why I'm playing this game, except because it's nice and pretty. So, <laughs> let's just keep picking out clothes and see if we can make like a matching nice color set. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, y'all? <laughs> well, clearly purple's not going to work out because I don't have enough purple. But, this blue and white-ish kind of thing is kind of working out, you know, a little bit. Because it's like blue and white and black, and that's like, those shoes are kind of gray, but you know, I don't, I have a limited, I have a limited thing to work with, so it's just going to have to make it work. That hat totally completes it. None of these skirts are going to work. None of those skirts are going to work. <laughs> yeah, man. White shirt with blending in on the white side. Yeah, look. Oh, we look so good. It looks so good. It looks so good. Don't even need to do it. Oh, we look so good. We look so good. Now, to complete this restyling, let's get a haircut, because why not? I don't know if I've taken a haircut yet in the game, but this is a nice time to do it. I don't like the lopsidedness of that. That looks weird. That looks... Ugh, ugh. Let's go with long hair. Long hair is my favorite. Is this different? Yeah, this is the one that we have. Layered long flip, please. <laughs> and while we're at it... Let's change our hair color, cause you know, live it up. <laughs> What's the world if you don't live a little? Change your hair color every now and then. Let's see here. Nah, I don't, that red is too red for me. That doesn't match like the blue white thing I just made. That's silly hair color. Warm brown, that's the one I'm gonna go with. Let's see what these highlights look like. I don't want those highlights in my hair, they look weird. This is pure. Warm, oh my god, $220? $220! Out of my 1055 Why does a haircut and some coloring cost $220? That's insane! <laughs> That's like... Let me do the math. That's like a quarter-ish of my butt. That's insane. But we do look good. But we do look good. There's no denying. <laughs> I don't know, I think we look very light and airy. It, it, it works well, I get, whatever. The money was spent. Can't do anything about it now. Now, we need to buy some clothes for our shop. Cause I'm pretty sure we're probably running low on stock. Cause I'm a bad shop owner person. Okay, Grace, I get it. Tutorial message, preview event. Fun times! But, like, come on. Let's see what's in Masquerade. Masquerade! Yes, thank you for your welcoming speech. I'm gonna buy whatever this is, because it's only one of them. Can't afford two of them, because I spent money on a haircut. Oh my god. I just bought Ninja Girl gloves. Hopefully, sometime later, <laughs> I'll get the rest of the outfit, baby. I don't know. The gloves seem like the least important part of that masquerade. But let's go buy some Mad Jack stuff, because you know, y'all know the girls at Asto lack Mad Jack stuff. That's why I'm dressed in all Mad Jack, to be matching with the product. Because that's what a good shop person keeper would do. Now, I, <laughs> I don't really care what I'm buying. I'm just kind of buying one of one or two or three of like whatever I don't have in my wardrobe. You only buy one or two or three, cause then you'll get, you'll never sell like 10, it's impossible. I know, cause I've been to the future, and this it's impossible to sell like 10 things in this game. It's like, 
That's too much. People don't come back that often. And it gets boring if selling the same thing. So let's just buy two. Well, that's an ugly thing. I don't want that. And also, when you buy stuff at the store, it gets added to your closet. And you get a copy for yourself. I don't think that's how that works. Maybe it does. I don't know. I'm not a fashion designer in real life. For all you all know. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure that's crazy talk to have one of everything. But whatever. Let's keep looking around. We need some outerwear, because you know girls are going to need outerwear. Uh, ugh. None of these dresses look good, but I know I know, someday someone's going to want a dress. And it's better to have it and not like it than be like, oh, I don't have a dress. Oh, those pants. Black. That's good. Black is simple. Everybody loves black. Man, those purple pants were loud. Red pants, not as loud. <laughs> Let's just buy some skirts, you know. This is all a part of running a wonderfully appropriate style beauty. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. Let's buy some boots. Because those regular shoes. Oh, uh, these shoes look okay. Oh my god, I'm. <laughs> I'm like broke, you guys. I'm all out of money. I have like I have nine dollars left. I should just give up, pack my bags, and go, because I have nine dollars left. And that is a terrible situation to be in as a shopkeeper. But it's gonna be oh Vicky, what's up Vicky girl? Oh red carpet movie. Let's scope it out. Let's do all that thing. <laughs> Let's go on a date with Vicky later today. It's gonna be so fun. I was gonna say romantic, but I mean, I don't think that's what that game implies. <laughs> Let's go help out this girl. She loves dogs and wants to own lots of dogs. I don't know. Like, you wanna be like a property manager? That's a very. You can misinterpret that sentence any way you want. <laughs> Uh, let's get her some clothes. Start by searching with the brand because these girls can't resist the brand name. Wait for them to try it off. Man, Magic. I feel like maybe I should switch brands. But whatever. I'm all in on Magic. <laughs> that top doesn't look good on you, but I don't care. Blech. I'm an irresponsible style boutique manager storefront person. You can't stop me. Uh, see you later, Jules. I love you. Bye-bye. Just kidding. I don't love you. <laughs> if I did love you, I'd give you better clothes. Oh, look at this goth lady with the red highlights in her hair and the bowl haircut. What's up, Martin? You look good today. <laughs> Whoa, I just read that Martine doesn't like clean- Dude, I love cleaning my ears. Martine doesn't like cleaning her ears. That's crazy talk. Cleaning your ears feels wonderful. Raven candle clothes for the goth girl. How do you look? Oh my goodness. Flowers everywhere. That's crazy. That top doesn't match your bottom. It looks really weird, but yay, flower petals! It's totally you! I know it, because Brandy! Martin, you would like a skirt from me? Let us see if I have a skirt from you in stock. Scroll down. Raven candle. Oh, that's a bummer. Let's just try and pick something that match like that. Black on white on black. That matches. Let's see if she locks it, even though it's not brand name, which is usually the easiest way to win at this game, but whatever. Come on! Lucky chance. Come on. I have to be lucky. I gotta be lucky. Gotta be lucky. Oh! I'm still lucky. Flower petals. I mean, that actually looks kind of good. I'm not gonna lie. That looks good. I think that looks kind of good. That looks kind of good to me. Her shoes are red, which mess everything up. But I mean, it goes with her hair, so I mean, that's nice. My sartorial soulmate. Yes, Martin. I am your sartorial soulmate. You bought the last of my stock. You are very lucky. 
You're a very lucky girl. <laughs> I don't even know what accent that is I'm supposed to be doing right now. Let's hop out that girl on the bottom because it's her first visit and you want to make a good first impression. Hello, Melissa. I'd like to try out new styles. Yeah, I don't see a book right now, but okay. Oh. Girl, you, your, your fun fact is you like to try out new styles and you don't buy anything from my store. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> What's wrong with you? I'm not gonna sell Zoe anything. She wants like the rich people stuff and I don't have that in my store. Marwenna, on the head of the hand, looks like a humbler girl who lacks pure cloth, some easy peasy monochromatic clothes, and I'm just gonna run on over to the place and buy some for her so I can sell it to her for a mock up and make sweet money! Sweet muns, huns! Yeah, yeah. I don't know what item she's gonna want, so let's just buy a couple of everything. Cause pure cloth girls are the easiest to please. Cause all their stock costs like, look at that. That mini skirt costs three dollars a piece. That's the same prices. I make hella profit. Well, not hella profit. I mean, obviously, I can't sell it for much more than what they're selling it to me. But it's easy. It's easy, breezy, beautiful. Style boutique. <laughs> oh man. Um. Oh gosh. Let's just keep. I need pants. I like these pants. I like the model of these pants. Like they're just simple, and I like them, and I want them for me. For me. That's the secret to this game. Just buy clothes that you like, because I mean, really cares about these girls. They'll buy anything. What matters is how you dress yourself. That's what's important. <laughs> Oh, I am a wash in pants. I'm drowning in these pants. Now let's go back. Actually, no. Oh, hey, look. Let's go to that red carpet event. It's a movie premiere with Vicky. What's... Oh, yeah. Stalin. You mean me. I'm the one who's Stalin here. What role would I like to play in a movie? Oh yeah, let's check ourselves out. Let's check ourselves out real quick. Oh. Mm-mm. I ain't gonna be no love interest to anybody. I would be a spy. I mean, I, would, <laughs> I wouldn't want to be a spy. I'd want to be something else. But I wouldn't want to be a love interest. I want to be the protagonist of my own movie. I hope Rokoko doesn't show up because I don't want to see Rokoko. Okay, cool. Hello, camera girl. Take my photo and then send it to me in the mail. Because this game is old and cell phones that take your picture weren't invented yet. Thank you. <laughs> now let's go to the shop and sell some more Wena. Oh, I didn't get you anything, Renee. I didn't get you anything. I'm never going to get you anything ever. Don't count on it. Don't ask me. Get out of my face. <laughs> let's help out more Wena. Cause I just bought clothes for her, so I'm sure to have something in stock for her. That's how the game is played. Oh, it's your day off. Cool, that's cool. Are you spending your day watching soaps? Live your life, Morwenna. <laughs> don't watch soaps every day. Be the so well, no, don't be the soap, cause then that just means you're having a lot of drama in your life. But you know. You get what I'm saying. Like, do the thing. Don't just watch the thing. Wait for her to change. She's done. Let's see the results. Do 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 Build up the suspense and voila! That doesn't look very good. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> it's fine. You're very pretty, Marwenna. Oh, well, it kind of matches her hair, so that's good. Like the jacket does. We're back to $85. You really don't make a lot of money on pure cloth. <laughs> oh, Gracie, what's up? Oh, hello. I don't want to know about the older. He's a smexy guy. That's, that's, that's the gist of his character in this game. And he's super nice, too. Okay, yeah, I get it. You don't have to rub it in my face. Gracie. <laughs> oh, shut up, Renee. You don't do any work around here. You don't do anything around here. 
I don't know why you're still here. Let's help out the girl in front, cause she obviously likes Mad Jack. What's her name? Joey! What's up, Joey? I don't know how you can eat apples by the bucket. I'd like to see that, Joey. Show me, show me, Joey. I'm just kidding, Joey can't show me. She's a girl in the computer video game. Anyways, let's get Joey some trousers. Pants. <laughs> let's get him some Mad Jack trousers. Let's get those red ones, because they kind of sort of match with her arm sleeve thing. I'm blanking. What's that called? Gloves. <laughs> oh my goodness. You're super protected. Hooray, Joey. Oh my god, Joey. Come back again and buy more clothes for me. It'll be easy to shop for you. Sell you stuff? I don't know. Stop trying to be helpful, Renee. You're never going to be helpful. Ever. Get out of my face. Let's help the girl at the top of the line. I mean, she's first. I assume this is supposed to represent like a Q. So, you know, let's go in order. Aloha, Naomi. How do you live in a spa? Can you live in a spa? Is that like a thing? Can you like rent out a spa and just live? You know what, Naomi? Go back to your spa. I don't need you. I don't need you in my life. <laughs> I don't need no girls who live in spas in my life. That's too much trouble for me. How much? I made $200 today. Yay. That's not a lot of money. I was at 1000 you guys. I'm broke. I'm basically the equivalent of broke. <laughs> well, <laughs> I think that's going to be it for the end of this episode. That's going to be all. Thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe, I guess, if you feel like it. I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you all next time.